What's up, everybody? Welcome back to a brand new video on the internet. And oh my gosh, what the fuck is wrong with people? Let me let me just put that. Let me just say that right now. What what is wrong with people? Especially what is wrong with people and content on YouTube? Like I have to say that. What what the fuck is wrong with people on this website? <laughs> Okay guys, so as you've heard from my intro of this video, <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with people on this website? And all of this is directing toward this, this small vlogger, if he wants to be categorized as one, he's not even really a vlogger from like the, the videos that show up on his channel. He just probably put it in the name because he, he thinks it's cool, it's cool to be known as a vlogger, which it's not really, most vloggers on YouTube don't have a good reputation, or they're just too kid friendly that it looks fake. But anyways, <laughs> besides all that, this guy, this guy has the audacity. He has the balls. He has the balls of steel, okay? This man has the audacity to not post one but post two, fucking two, two, three a.m. videos calling dead people. Four days ago, he he um uploaded a video calling uh Caroline Flack, who died Saturday four four or five days ago. She passed away, and on the day of me uploading this, two hours ago, just fucking two hours ago, he uploads a video FaceTiming. Pop Smoke, if you don't know who Pop Smoke is, he was a rapper who died, I believe, today, February 19th, this morning. And this kid has the audacity to upload that video. And then, let me just say this right away. Well, what he's doing, it's fucking, um, it's bad. It's, it's honestly bad. It's bad. It's not just bad for him. It's it's bad for the image he wants to put online. Because I went through his channel. I went. I didn't watch his videos, but but just from looking at his titles, his YouTube video titles, he doesn't look like a bad guy. He like like seriously. If you just go through his videos, he just has um, video titles and thumbnails for some of them that make you want to click. I never clicked any of them because I don't really feel this guy feel like giving this guy any viewership. Um, but again, this this is fucking stupid. This is ridiculous. Because this is recent. He hasn't done any other 3am videos from my knowledge. It's, I take that back. I just searched on his channel 3am. He has done 3am videos or challenges if you want to call it but he hasn't really he hasn't done this kind of 3am where he's calling up people dead people for content and the only reason this guy's doing this is for attention and um and in a way to be noticed online <laughs> like like Mimla said it on his video on this guy any publicity is good publicity I'm sorry I can't say that word correctly it has my tongue in a fucking knot okay but any good any good publicity is any publicity is good publicity and that's what he said in his video and that's what this kid is doing because he knows he knows he's going to get, he's getting views from this. He knows he's getting attention. When you Google this kid's YouTube name, there's a news article on him. Okay? And I can kind of relate to this kid because from looking at him, he looks like he's around the same age as me. I've done similar things. I've done bad things on the internet to get attention. I would tell you, I will confirm you myself, it does work, but at what cost? Because let, let's be real here, a, a week ago or so, um, 
I, I did, I did, I would say now, reflecting on it, a very shitty thing on Twitter. Um, you can watch the video about it. Um, it's, it's the one before this one, if you go on my channel. Or it'll probably be at the end card. But anyways, I did some, I did a stupid thing on Twitter to get attention. It fucking worked. I was, again, a lot of people were, were messaging me, responding to me, messaging me for about 24 hours straight. But, none of them were kind, none of them were like, hey, I like you, or hey, you are a cool guy, no, they were all responses like, hey, fuck you, kill yourself, you're a cunt, you know? So, it's kind of different in my perspective, in the way I've, I've done bad stuff online, if you want to say that, because I don't show my face. I don't show my face because I know if I do something bad and my face is on camera and it like if there's a possibility of that if it gets spread to like news sources I'm fucked for life because I'm going to be recognized as the guy who does that stupid thing because I've done something I've done something like very bad um back in June of 2019 I did something so bad that I believe I, I had like two or three news articles written on me but the, I would say the only benefit from that was that my face wasn't involved in it. So they, so no one really knows who the person is. And I used the username of this channel. So if they search this name, you won't get any face. You won't really get any like face review or anything about it. So I kind of played it safe so I can't be identified as easily. But this guy, he doesn't give a fuck. He, he, this guy seriously doesn't give a fuck. He goes on full face cam, calling dead people. Like, that is something to be proud of. And I guarantee you, 10, maybe 15 years from now, or maybe 5, maybe 5 years, we'll give it that. Maybe 5 years from now, this guy is going to look back on his channel, and he's going to realize how stupid he was. And it's kind of sad right now that he doesn't realize this is a bad thing that he's doing. For me, it's different. Okay? When I do something in the moment, I don't think of it as a bad thing. But after within 24 hours or so, sometimes 12 hours depending on the situation, I realize I've done something very stupid, I screwed up, and I try to fix the issue. This guy doesn't care. He knows he's doing something bad. But he continues to do it. And I'm very surprised. Like, I have to ask this question. And if he's watching this, I would like for him to answer. If he hasn't answered this already. Does his parents monitor his channel? He doesn't, they don't really have to though. Because if he's a budget, if he's above at the age of 13, which I'm pretty sure he is. He has full rights to his channel, which means he can do whatever he can really do with his channel. But at the same time, dude. You should upload content whether or not your parents are monitoring it because I'm pretty sure if your parents actually found this on your channel, they would probably be very disappointed in you and look down upon you. I know my family would. They would probably disown me if I did something like this. Something this cynical. Okay? This is, this is stupid. Okay? Um, like... Or maybe his parents do know he's doing this and they just and they just don't give a fuck. Because they know it's gonna bring traction to his channel. And they know traction to his channel, which equals money. This guy monetizes these videos. Yes, these two three AM videos that he's uploaded are fucking monetized. He's making revenue off these videos. It, it's just fucking stupid what this guy's doing. I hope he doesn't continue this, because He's going down a bad road, and this road's not going to end well for him. He's either going to get deleted from YouTube, if he, conti if he continues doing this, okay? He's either going to get deleted from fucking YouTube.com, which I don't have any problem doing, because I don't, from, because I don't really favor this guy. Or, he just, he's not going to become as successful as he plans to be on YouTube, because of the content he makes. But hey, you know, look at Jay Station. He uploads this basically the same kind of stuff. 
exploring dead people with four views. And he he's doing well for himself. He's getting paid a good amount of money. He has five million subscribers. He's living the life. And I believe this kid, I would say he probably has inspiration from that guy. Or he either just knows that this is just such a trendy thing that people do that you'll get clicks on it. And it's kind of stupid that people click on these videos because they're all they're all the fucking same. Okay? They're all the fucking same. There's someone, it's someone in the room at 3 a.m. We don't even know if it's actually 3 a.m. But I'm going to assume it's 3 a.m. Just to make it sound a little more realistic. It's 3 a.m. And they're pretending to call someone or message someone who they claim who the 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 or who they're saying is dead. Anyways, to sum this up, this video is pretty long. I was originally I was going to think, hey, let's do like a reaction commentary to this guy's um channel, but there's no need to give him attention. This video is already giving him enough enough tension, but I'm pretty sure he doesn't care what I'm saying. He doesn't care that he's getting his backlash. And it's okay to feel that way, but you should definitely know that this is a bad thing. People, like, this has been happening for, like, over a year. People have been exploiting other people, deaths for views, that scenario. And this is just another case, and this is, sadly, it's just, this is just, this is just one guy trying to get attention. Or fame, or whatever, whatever he wants out of this, I'm pretty sure it's attention. Uh, but he's going the wrong route. So hopefully, these are the only videos he does at 3 a.m. But I'm doubting it. If he's uploaded already two within under a week, I wouldn't be surprised if when the next person dies, he's going to hop on that video as well. And the fucking sad thing about it's not just that he's exploiting dead people for views it's that he uploads them within the f the same day that they're dead or they're announced dead that's that's the that's the sad thing about this that he doesn't wait a few days like Jay station did what he, what he did is still bad but he waited a few days and then uploaded the video no this guy probably records the video once he actually hears that the person died once he checks his Twitter or Instagram, whatever social media platform he's on, he's on and he, he, he reads that this person's been dead or died from something or somewhat. He's like, oh, new banger, views, yes, yes, I want that. So, like, it's, it's fucking sad. Um, it's, it's, it's fucking bullshit, dude. This guy is literally... I don't, I don't know. I I don't really have anything else to say. I'm I'm basically just done. I can't speak anything else. I've spoken everything I could say about this guy. Um, the most I can say is that go to his channel if you want. Um, but if you do, stay clear of the, of the 3 a.m. dead people videos because that's where he wants the views. You can watch his other content. From what I see, they don't look that bad. But those two. Those are bad, and he needs he needs a wake up call of some sort. Um, sometimes, hopefully, it's kind of it's brought to him in a way that he realizes what he's doing is fucking stupid. But till then, he's probably just gonna keep up doing this stuff. So, anyways, guys, I just like to say this: fuck this guy. He's an asshole. He's a cunt. He's everything that people have called me the past week on Twitter. Um. But yeah guys, the basic of this video, hope you guys enjoyed it. Um next video will be I don't know, commentary video, story time video, whatever happens. Uh, I may make another video on this guy. If if he goes out online and even falls out online if he's done it as he if he if as he's done already. I don't know. But I think this is the only video I'm gonna make on this guy. I just had to speak about this. A lot of people have spoken about this, but I just need to speak about this as well. It's fucking stupid. And he needs to stop. But anyways, guys, that's it for this video. If you guys are interested, click the links down in the description. If you're interested in um, checking me out or supporting me even more or even further uh, if you've done so already. Um, and yeah, see you guys next time. Hopefully, no other fuckers 
try to do this for attention because they should know it's wrong. He should know it's wrong. And yeah, that's it for this video. Hope you, hope you have a good rest of your day. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.